This is a Game Caviar production. Okay, so not having it in the Game Caviar Studios. You already know what I'm playing. Except this time, playing it on a computer. I find this game to be a lot easier on a computer. But you still gotta worry about the campers. And the drop shooters. There's a lot of drop shooters in here. I don't know if it's the same for everybody. But for me, it's a lot of drop shooters. Got some games coming to the channel. Mostly on the computer. Uh, Splinter Cell. I play. I mean, I bought this game a long time ago. Never played it. I'm gonna start playing it. Just Cause 2 was on sale for three dollars. I bought it. Just got finished downloading it. As soon as I get my bearings in that game, I'm gonna play it. I'm gonna start doing more games on the computer. I got Fraps. I bought it. I started recording gameplay with it. You're watching one of them right now. It's pretty awesome. I saw. Uh, Dark Knight Rises the other day. It was awesome. I paid extra for this movie. It was like, it wasn't IMAX. It was kind of like IMAX. It had a screen that was big and it was curved, like kind of around the walls. It was weird. I don't know what it was, what the whole deal was. We had nice, I, I don't know whether they were real leather seats. They were kind of like vinyl seats. It doesn't really matter. It was a movie theater, but they reclined back and everything. You had a nice big ass cup holders for little cups, you know. And the movie was amazing, and it was really good. I don't think they're gonna make another one. They, I mean, they're gonna make another Batman movie. I don't know whether Christopher Nolan is gonna be involved in it. I hope so, or maybe Zack Snyder, the guy who's working on Superman, was would do both Superman and Batman. That would be amazing. I don't know whether that will happen. I'm being optimistic. The way that the movie ended, made it made it seem like it was gonna be another movie. But I don't know. I'm trying to stay optimistic, but I do not know. I'm not going to ruin the movie for those of you who haven't seen it. I will just say that it is awesome. Thoughts and prayers go out to the people of Colorado. The victims of that, that shooting was crazy lunatic. Went in there and just shot up the movie theater for some stupid reason. You don't really have... There's never a good reason to go kill innocent people. You, you ever notice that? I mean, it, there's never been an, a good reason to just... Go somewhere public and just start shooting. Uh, he, this guy's obviously mentally deranged and uh, he's got some problems, some issues. So you know, whatever. What he did was absolutely wrong and it shouldn't have happened. And like I said, uh, rest in peace to the people who died and I hope for a speedy recovery for the people who were injured. It's a lot of brave people though. A lot of people who laid down on their friends and family so they could escape or live so even in the midst of terror um, people still managed to pull together and that was a really good thing to hear about so this match ends in a, uh, a rage quick because I got my ass handed to me in so many ways this is probably the worst match that I played on a computer I also play Modern Warfare 2 on a computer oh yeah you know what uh, no screw all that Modern Warfare 2 talk this game right here aimbots out the ass and you don't really know until you watch the kill cam like i had to figure out what button was my kill cam because i swapped it around so i had time to view these kill cams aimbots all over the place which is horrible but anyway like comment subscribe spread the word i'm not having it and i'm out this has been a game caviar production like this video and subscribe for more